Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel. Thank you for clicking on today's video. As you can see, we've got a Timu haul today. So I've been on the app again and that's where you get the best offers. But oh, the algorithm, it knows what I want. So I've got some more bits to show you. I've got home, clothing, miscellaneous, random items, quite a few bits. I do have another discount code for them. If you are interested, I'll leave that below. Uh, but yeah, let's get on into the video. What I'll do is I'll leave the latest prices on the screen somewhere because they do swap and change all the time and I can't remember them anyway off the top of my head but I am going to start with home and the first item I've got is the most cutest mug I feel like this would make a really lovely gift so it's got these purple tulips on which I thought was very seasonal for this time of year I really like that it's on a cream background rather than a white and you can see how it's like this really natural finish it's very sort of like homemade looking and it did come in quite a nice um cardboard box i have ripped it a little bit trying to get into it but it would make a really lovely gift for your mom sister friend or, or for yourself and it is quite a dainty mug so what i would say is um like my nan for example she doesn't like to drink a lot in one go so if you know anybody like that that would be perfect oh do you know what would be the dream if you've got one of those really nice big greenhouses with a little chair and table setting and then you're having a tea in this or having like an afternoon tea with mugs like this because they did have several different types of these mugs several different patterns all of them were really really pretty but i just couldn't resist this purple tulip one the next item that i picked up was this crystal table lamp now there are several different shapes that you can go for so it's usb charged so if you don't have plug sockets near your bed or by like an area that you want lit up this would be ideal for that now it's a lovely antique brass color in fact let me get it out so i can show you what it looks like so i went for this shape and i just think it's really really nice and it is is it glass or is it plastic i can't tell actually kind of feels like plastic but it's making a glass noise but I don't know if that's just because of the metal I really love the colour of the stand and the stem oh I've just popped it on so there's several different settings so there's a warm light there's quite a white light which is quite good if you're having it in the bathroom and you want to do your makeup it's like an in-between and then there's off so yeah it's just a little touch one as well so it's super easy to turn on and off and yeah I just thought this was really really cute like I said I think these would make good bedside table lamps or if you've got like a little nook like a reading nook I think this would look really cute as well the next thing I bought for the home might be a little bit random but I bought this um bathroom mat because my hubby doesn't like the one that we've got at the moment I have to admit it is white and I do fake tan so it's not the greatest combination but this one is a really really lovely patterned mat i like the fact that it's not like stark white it's on this really lovely creamy colored background it's the, just a print of like all flowers and leaves and you can get this in different sizes i went for the medium one to be fair i probably could have got away with a small one because our bathroom is actually quite small and it's really just like foldable and if you don't have it down all the time so we tend to throw ours over the top of the bath but i think this is just going to look really nice we've got like a, a black picture frame in there and i think the black in this is just going to really pull that out and look make the bathroom look a little bit more put together talking of bathroom these really do work so i've just picked up one of those hair stoppers that you put on the plug i just went for the gray because our bathroom is like grays and beiges so yeah just thought that would look nice and kind of understated okay so moving on to a little bit of clothing and the first item that i picked up i'm the most excited about out of all the clothes in, and it's these tan coloured shoes so I've noticed in the winter I've been wearing my tan boots a lot and I need something to almost replace those as spring and summer come in now I love the fact this has got a tiny little heel on it so it's going to be super comfortable but give you that little bit of height um, I love that these are pointed toe as well I feel like that's very very feminine and they're almost like this fey, um, faux suede material which yeah it's just absolutely gorgeous and I think they're going to go with so much stuff so I'm thinking dresses jeans and they're that sort of shoe that look a little bit more dressed up so it looks like you've put some effort in even if you're like just going on the school run or yeah just gonna go and do the groceries or whatever but yeah they are padded on the inside as well which I'm really surprised about 
um, and so with my last team of shoes actually um, they've got some quite nice padding so if you like something a little bit softer on your feet these might be a good option and yeah just very very chuffed with those and I think they're going to go with the next dress so I did pick up a summer dress as we're now coming into spring and summer aren't we so I went for this really lovely blue and white one so it's got like some scrunchy detail at the front it is a square neckline and it's got kind of these puffy sleeves and then it's just kind of like long and flowy so I think this will be midi slash maxi on me midaxi probably um and yeah it's just this really beautiful sort of blue and white print what I will say though is the fabric is is quite thin which will be great in summer but you will have to be careful what underwear that you put underneath it you're definitely going to need something nude that's for sure um, but I thought again that would look nice with those tan shoes nice tan bag even if you're just like knocking about in the garden garden parties or yeah or just go to the shops you know just sometimes it's nice to feel a little bit pretty so yes not bad for the price at all do you know what i wasn't going to jump in and talk about the dress anymore but i have to say i am so impressed i was a little bit worried about the fabric when i first felt it because obviously it's not the most expensive fabric for the price but i have to say once you've got it on it just falls so prettily so i feel like this would make a perfect just summer out ingestion if you're going around like one of the old country houses or if you're going on a romantic picnic this dress is absolutely gorgeous and it feels so comfy when it's on it's going to be so light and light weight in the summer and also if you're like me and burn easily it means that you can stay cool even though your arms and shoulders are covered and I also want to say about the shoes as well so comfy fit perfectly so if you have problems like me where like stiff hard shoes rub your feet these are so pliable and they're so soft I cannot imagine that these are going to rub so yeah absolutely perfect i am so chuffed with the clothing in this haul and then because we know that it is going to be an english summer i have picked up a brolly um this is a really lovely navy one in fact it's finished off really nicely it is one of those where you just push it and it goes up and it's got a really nice silver button on it i feel like this looks really smart and do you know what it goes nice with that dress doesn't it do you know when it's like a rainy hot day and it's got a loop on i mean it is a standard ish brolly you can see that it comes with this but to be fair i do tend to just throw these away because I can never get the brollies back in them. Um, but it does have the Velcro on it. And yeah, you know, you just need it, don't you, in the British summer because it's going to rain. And yeah, I don't really go anywhere without a brolly. I've always got one in the back of my car. And to be fair, I'm not the best at... Do you know when I put something down and remembering to pick it back up? So they do get lost quite a bit. But I thought this was quite a nice one that I can throw it in the back of the car. Another clothing item I picked up because I just want to try this style is a little, it's like a knitted cardigan, very Chanel vibe. So it's cream, it's got the black detail and then it's got these really nice gold buttons on. And I just thought it's quite lightweight. So even though it's obviously starting to get a little bit warmer, I think this is going to be really wearable. I think you could definitely dress this up, dress this down. So I'm thinking just some black trousers to go to the office with the black and white Timu shoes actually that I got last time, I think would look nice and a black bag. Um, but then also with a skirt or some jeans, I thought this would go as well. And the fabric is super, super soft. Obviously I don't know how it's going to wash, but yeah, the fabric is incredibly soft. So yeah, very, very pleased with that. And it's very my style at the moment just creams and navies and blacks i'm just really really enjoying another clothing item well not really it's more, <laughs> it's more like a toy really i picked this um dressing up dress for my daughter now i did get one of these for my youngest birthday but my eldest absolutely loved it and the one that i got her is sold out but this is very very similar so it's got pink sequins on it's lilac it's got lace on it so it's very rapunzel-esque which they really really like and i have to say for the price of these dresses because you can see all the details on them they are so cheap and i think the quality of them is actually better than the disney dresses that you know the disney dresses that you buy um, unless you're going to pay for like the super duper expensive ones but the ones that you get in like the supermarkets this is so much better quality and it's really really puffy and cute so yeah i think she's gonna love that but i'm gonna have to hold that for quite a while because her birthday isn't until yet and then i suppose these are quite miscellaneous items but i wanted to show you them anyway so first things first i picked up this wireless micro 
microphone um, now if you guys do any youtubing or anything like that i do want to try and up the quality of my videos and i'd love to have really crisp sound so i can't actually put a microphone into my camera so i'm hoping that i can link this up to my phone and then start using that and hopefully the audio will sound a lot better especially because it can be quite noisy in the house with the kids and stuff i am aware of that sometimes in the background so yeah i'm going to give those a go and i think this was literally like three pounds now i find um, good microphones probably the hardest thing to find and um, the best microphone that I have is a two pound one that I got from Carbu. absolutely amazing so yeah I'm really hoping that that works and then another electrical item that I got I feel like we all use these these are the bluetooth earphones they come in a really smart black case so um i use wired ones for when i'm in bed so that i don't lose them but when i'm out and about i do like to use the wireless ones so they come in this really smart black case and then oops there we go you can see on here oh it's flashing on the screen it's not flashing in real life um well it's flashing a bit but not like flickering like it is on the screen and you can see what i like about this one is it does show you the charge some of the cheaper ones don't um, so yeah this is handy to just have in your handbag on the go or if you're working and you're able to listen to audio then yeah just great to keep in your pocket and when you're out and about and then if you're like me my car does have a usb charger so i tend to just keep um, that in there and then plug them in when i get back in the car so that they're always charged up and ready to go and then this is probably the most random item from the haul but it's this pair of football socks where you put your shin pad down now my daughter has recently started football and was looking at all different sorts of clubs and even football which you think would be relatively cheap to start you have to have the football kit the socks etc so if your kid is starting a club and you don't know if they're going to like it but they do need some kit or some items i'd recommend going to timo and checking out if you can get some of the bits cheaper first and um, these aren't actually for my daughter though they are for my hubby um because he's having problems with the shin pads that they are moving around so these are these socks you actually put the shin pad in the middle of them to help keep them in place so yeah but I just want to give a shout out to any like items that you need for classes and clubs or even like crafts when you've got to decorate for like book day and Easter and all other stuff as well. Um, yeah, Timu is a really good place to go. So I really hope you enjoyed that haul. Don't forget to check out the app and download it because you get all the best deals on there. I do have a discount code, like I said, so I'll leave that on screen. Um, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and you like this video. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Bye bye.